It is under the St. Matthew's Catholic Church in East Syracuse where numerous people get the basic necessities for living in a tough economy. For over 40 years, the second time around store and food pantry has served low-income families in its community. Mike Lazinski, the current store manager, says the store was originally founded by Ginny Flavin. Flavin started the store as a tribute to her son who died in the Vietnam conflict. Ginny Flavin started this store. She lost a son during the Vietnam War. And one of her things in remembrance of her son was to start his food pantry. Every Thursday morning, afternoon, and evening, the store opens its doors and offers many goods for purchase. All items sold are gently used donations that are cleaned up and priced between five cents and one dollar. Even with low prices, the store makes around fifteen hundred dollars every Thursday. And for every item sold at the church store, it just doesn't mean another dollar's profit. It means another can of food for someone really in need given out at the food pantry. All profit made from the store is used to buy food from the CNY Food Bank. The food is then given out to more people in need. Uh, for the month of January, we uh, handled 170 families. And of those, um, 314 were adults and 147 were children. Every family fed is another job well done for the pantry, which would not be possible without the store's profit. For On TV News, I'm Nikki Piscopo.